hello everyone welcome back to our channel login 8 in this video i will guide you on how to use wego app so if you also want to use wego app this video is just for you follow the simple steps and you'll be able to do it so first of all what you have to do is install the wego application you can easily install this application from play store and app store once the application has been installed simply open it now wait for it to load make sure to create an account for yourself make sure you're logged into your account i'm already logged into my account you can see over here wego application has been opened initially you'll be led to the home interface from this interface you'll be able to book the flights and hotels you'll also be able to enjoy the facilities like business travel eSIM, airport transfers also you'll be able to explore the popular destination visa free countries weekend getaways etc if you want to book the flight simply tap on the option flights that you can see right over here now you can see over here you'll be led to this kind of interface from here you'll be able to book the flight you can book the one-way flight also you'll be able to book the round trip and multi-city simply tap on the option of your choice now all you have to do is select the destination that you're flying from simply tap on the option from that you can see right over here now select the destination for yourself tap on the destination that you're flying from also select the destination that you're flying to simply tap on the option to now select the destination for yourself also make sure to select the departure date and return date simply tap on the option departure date now from here you'll be able to pick the departure date simply tap on the date of departure also you'll be able to select the return date simply tap on the date that you're returning also you'll be able to select the number of passengers tap on this option that you can see right over here now from here you'll be able to select the number of passengers you can see the options like adult child and infant over here tap on the plus icon right next to the option that you want to add like this you'll be able to select the number of passenger also you'll be able to select the cabin class you can see the options over here economy premium economy business and first class simply tap on the option that is suitable for you now tap on the right icon that you can see right over here on this screen you can also select the payment method you can see over here these payment methods are selected after that all you have to do is tap on the option search flights that you can see right over here now you'll be able to search for the flight you can see the result over here from here you'll be able to select the flight tap on the flight that you like the best now go ahead and book the flight likewise you can also book the hotel simply tap on the hotels option that you can see right over here on the home interface now you'll be able to book the hotel select the destination check in and check out date number of people after that simply tap on the option search hotels now you'll be able to search for the hotels you can see the option for hotel over here you can go ahead and book the hotel now if you look at the bottom you'll be able to find the options like home explore stories and account right now you're in the home interface if you tap on the option explore you can see over here you'll be led to the explore interface from here you'll be able to explore the popular destination also you'll be able to plan your getaway if you tap on the stories option you'll be able to read the latest blogs over here simply tap on the travel blog that you want to read now you can enjoy reading the blog now if you tap on the account icon that you can see at the bottom right corner of your screen you'll be led to your profile interface from here you'll be able to access the profile options you'll be able to find the option like personal info preferred payment method also you'll be able to find the option for my trips from here you'll also be able to access the settings you'll be able to change the language currency and reason you can also change the appearance also you'll be able to access the settings for notifications and account and security from here you can also contact the help center if you want to log out of your account you can simply tap on the option log out and after that you'll be logged out of your account you can also explore other options in wego application like this so that is how you use wego app i hope you found this video helpful thank you for watching make sure to like share and subscribe to our channel